We've had no shortage of interesting DIYs on Kelloland Living, with everything from custom Barbie Five berets to the ever important crocheted kitten paws. But today we're continuing to place a new edge on our DIYs. That's because we're breaking out the placemats once again to create a custom clutch that will perfectly match your fascinating placemat fascinator we created already. That's right. So we had these hats we did for the Derby or for, you know, an English wedding, whatever you want to do. And we had some more placemats, and these placemat purses. Uh huh. They're ready for it. Okay. They are. So okay. we're gonna do one that's more of like a clutch version first. And what we have are two different kinds of fast, um, like fasteners. Oh, okay. But so I think the first steps are to get the fastener on because right. if you sew everything else up or glue everything else up, you're gonna be hard. Okay. So to do that, I think fold your placemat in thirds like a burrito. Okay. Kind of get the placement where you want it to be. Sure. And then you've got the kind of clasp that's magnetic closure that yeah. you would sew in on each side. Okay. Or probably, I mean, could use some kind of glue, but you're sewing it in there yeah. on that one. I just started it, yep. And then I have one of these that ends up being more of this like toggle. So you put each one on each side and then you put this through and you can open oh, it. Yeah, yeah, I like and that. And so I'm going to try this one while you get that one sewn Okay. On. Okay. Okay. Um, it was a little more, it's a little more difficult than I thought, actually. It, it takes a minute, but you'll, <laughs> you'll, you'll get there. Yeah. So once the clasp is on, then we're going to actually sew it into place. Uh, tell me how we're going to sew it into place by hand, or are we going to, I mean, the actual purse, we're going to glue it? Well, we okay, it? we can sew or we can glue. Okay. I think we're going to, the easy way, especially if you're just trying to match an outfit one time, you know, I think yeah. it's easy to glue. You could also do some of those, like, brad fasteners in on oh, the outside yeah. would work. Okay, so this is how easy this is. These fasteners, they just, I stick it through. You're kidding. And look, it goes right through the back like this. And then you just attach. And then it's just got little fold downs. I'm going to reinforce it with this little reinforcing piece. So Guess it what? I picked the wrong fastener. Um, That's what yeah. I'm realizing. Yeah. And I also asked you to do that one. <laughs> it's all coming to me now. There's a reason. <laughs> And so once There's you get a reason why you asked. Once you get that on, you just fold like these are kind of like <laughs> once those tacks. You get that on. <laughs> Next year, once you get that on. Okay. Now on the other side to get the other side on, this is where I do have to do a little bit more here. Um, I've got to kind of just see. It's got a front and a back too. I got to make sure I get it right in the right spot here. Yeah. So let's see. I'm gonna this line it up. This is fascinating. Fascinating. Now the problem with this now of what I have here is that I do still need to be able to get through. And so this is where I have to make a little a little little surgery incision here. Okay. Like what? I just got to cut through it. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw. Because that way I can get all the way through my Okay. Okay. So now I'm going to take it out here and I'm just going to kind of trim this up a little bit neater. Mhm. Mm um. This is one of my favorite kinds of of what? Clasps okay. to use because it is so easy and it's really like, I think, fashionable. I didn't even know that it existed. Okay. So I'm going to put um, it back in. And also, by the way, I don't know if I told you this, but this particular, um, what do you call it? A, a clutch? A cl what do you call it? Yeah, clutch? like a clutch. A clutch. I see. This particular one, I'm going to make it a jackrabbit clutch. Look at Yeah. You got a little thing. Yeah. I okay, can so. Give it as a gift to my jackrabbit friends. Now that I've got my clasps in here. Mm hmm. All attached. There you go. See, just like that. <laughs> so I'm going to keep you. You can okay. move on with me and we'll get the rest of the clasps in later. Okay. You've got time to get the magnets in. Okay. So once that's in, you're also going to need to fold the sides in, right? All right. Because this is how this is going to work. You're going to actually fold in each side and then you're going to match it up and fold it up like this. And then this will be coming down, right? Did okay. I fold it right? Oh, no. Inside to go first, right? Yeah. Or the, I mean, yes. Okay. I got it. So I'm and just going like to get a little glue. And then. And you can do this on a sewing machine. Mm hmm But you're saying glue works just as well? I think so, particularly if you're using a placemat and you are going to be able to, um, you know, you're just using it because you want something that looks fashionable for a night with your bag. Right. That's a good point. And then when I fold it up, it's going to match up like this. See that? I love it. So I just want to make sure I'm matching up my clasp. Yeah. That's what I'm worried about is matching. <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. Okay. So So here's the glue. Thank you. And you want to get it all the way glued up here. I'm gonna get more, a little more glue. You almost have to hold this glue in place for a little bit, I noticed. Keep when it, going. it comes to this material, I mean. Yeah. Yeah. I would say you're right about that. The this like kind of raffia. Oh, but be careful not to do what I uh, 
almost did. And did you glue it all the way together almost? No, but, but it, it could easily happen. <laughs> so I, I guess leave this part open, right? You would right, glue these right, parts. right, 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 okay. yeah. Because okay. uh, you want to be able to use the uh, clutch. Okay. Oh, this is going to work good, I think. Yeah. And then, and then you can add something to the side if you want. You just close it right up there. You could add little like hooks so you can hold it like a clutch. Oh, yeah. And then while you finish that up, I'm going to show you one more idea. Mm -hmm. You can take two of them, mm -hmm. fold them each in half. Okay. okay fold them yeah. each in half. See that? Yes. Okay. Then I'm going to tuck them into e each other like that. Yeah. I could have just, now I can pin it from here and just sew a seam on each side to sew them together if I want it to stay a little bit better. Yeah. And then though, look at this. It's a heart. It's a heart bag. A heart purse. And as soon as it's sewn together, I'll be able just to have a little, it's like a kind of a tote. <laughs> I right? love it. And then what I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna really sew this one. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to our desk and sew because I want it to be nice. <laughs> but how's that working? Good actually, I'm pretty impressed. Then we've I'm got fairly these, impressed with myself. <laughs> I am too, it looks great. Yeah. I've got these little, um, uh, yeah. edges and I'm going to put them on the edge and oh, then wow. this is a bag we previously made when we did that mesh. Yes, Remember yes. This? Oh, that's a beautiful bag. I love that. And here's that how one. the magnetic thing will work once you sew it in. Oh, that's perfect. Right? But I'm just going to take the um, extra <laughs> thing off the side and honestly, if you wanted to do this and glue the edges yeah. and you don't even have to necessarily put like a strap on the outside because these placemats are so easy just to like, look at that. I could go right through the edge with my little clip. What do you think? That's beautiful. Do you heart it? I heart it. Do you heart mine? I do. Go Jax. 